Tel Megiddo has undergone excavation by four different expeditions, starting from the early 20th century. The site has been continuously inhabited from Neolithic times to the Persian period, revealing over 30 layers of settlements. Megiddo plays a vital role in the study of the Bronze and Iron Ages in the Levant and broader regions due to its well-preserved stratigraphy, ceramic typology, and radiocarbon dating, along with extensive remains and significant monuments uncovered. During the Bronze and Iron Eye Ages, Megiddo was the central city-state for the Canaanites, and in the Iron II Age, it became an important administrative center for the Biblical Kingdom of Israel. The site is referenced in Egyptian, Assyrian, and possibly Hittite texts, and is also mentioned in the Hebrew Bible. Megiddo is identified in the New Testament's Book of Revelations as the location of Armageddon, from the Greek term Har Megiddo, meaning the Mound of Megiddo. Genetic studies reveal that since the Bronze Age, the region saw an influx of East African-related ancestry, averaging $10.6%, higher in Ethiopian Jews at 80%, and a European-related ancestry, averaging 8.7%, higher in Ashkenazi Jews at 41%. This East African component is most pronounced in Ethiopian Jews and North Africans, Moroccans and Egyptians, and is present in all Arabic-speaking populations except the Druze. From the groups we have examined, the only one that is somewhat diverged from the rest is Sidon. We provide evidence against the possibility that this observation is a batch effect, methods S1C. Rather, we suggest that the relative remoteness of Sidon stems from the fact that this population is genetically heterogeneous, with different individuals showing resemblance to different southern Levantine groups, methods S1C. During the second millennium BCE, Sidon was a major port city and was connected in trading relations with the eastern Mediterranean basin, which could have led to a significant genetic inflow, making its population more heterogeneous than that of inland cities. This may also be the reason that the site that most resembles Sidon is Ashkelon, which is another coastal site. The only inland population that resembles Sidon is Abel Beth Maka, perhaps because of its geographic proximity, figure 1a, figure 2. Apart from Sidon, Baka also shows some minor deviations from the rest when taking a richer set of outgroup populations, figure 3. The Baka is located on the fringe of the Syrian desert, hence this population might be admixed with more eastern groups, which are not yet genetically sampled. This might be reflected by the fact that the individuals of the Baka also show some degree of variability in their ancestry patterns. Megiddo, 4518, a glimpse into life in the Levant Bronze Age. Megiddo 4518 was identified as belonging to a Semitic lineage TCTS 2214 haplogroup. This genetic classification connects him to populations with origins in West Asia, specifically the Mesopotamian region. The Mesopotamian influence is significant, as this area is known as one of the cradles of civilization, contributing immensely to the cultural and genetic makeup of the broader Near Eastern and Levantine populations. Provides a profound window into the ancient past, illuminating the lives of individuals who lived during the Levant Bronze Age, specifically between 1550, 1300 BCE. Found in the region now known as Tel Megiddo, Zikron Yaakov, Israel, this individual's remains have offered invaluable insights into the genetic lineage, cultural affiliations, and historical context of the period. This paper delves into the significance of Megiddo 4518, exploring the details provided by Agronaut Tamir et al. in their 2020 study and how it enhances our understanding of the ancient Levant region historical context and cultural background. Tel Megiddo, an archaeological site in northern Israel, is one of the most important Bronze Age sites in the Levant. The region was a bustling hub of activity and interaction, known for its strategic importance and vibrant cultural exchanges. 
The period between 1550, 1300 BCE, was marked by significant developments in society, trade, and warfare, shaping the history of the ancient Near East. Megiddo 4518, an individual associated with the Megiddo Cultural Group, represents a segment of this complex historical tapestry. The Megiddo Group, known for their advanced urban planning and economic prosperity, played a critical role in the cultural landscape of the time.